Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here. Welcome to another part of Adabu and the Energy Thieves. Today is part three. Yes, that is right. Part three of Adabu. And uh, today, we're going to be going to... Is it the... Yep, that's right, this is a volcano. Ooh. Bisbee told me this robot uses the volcano's lava to make energy. You. I wonder how he stands the heat. Oof. Let's go and catch him. Man, he's such a witty guy, Adabu. Like, for a four-year-old or whatever. See, look, see, that's the trick now. Uh, that's a new trick. Basically, if you, ju if you jump and hold, uh, you can do that. Now, I think what that's meant to be is, um, for example, in those little bits where you're falling, right, it's to give you extra weight so you don't have to, um, you know screw up or you know you know when you know when you're falling and stuff like that and you know you got to get you have like one opportunity to get him if you go like this you you know much more likely that you won't miss it so that is very that's very useful um for when we do some backtracking and stuff like that oh, there you go oh this is some stuff this is the stuff i kind of remember from um oh my goodness uh, some of the stuff I remember from um, um, the the demo of this game, like those, like the 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 video demo. Sorry. Um, uh, what are we missing? Are we missing anything down there? Anything secret? What's this? Oh, very nice. Right. The music in this one's also really good too. It's got quite a nice. Uh, relaxed feel to it but still kind of a bit more urgent now we're, we're making it to the bloody volcano the music needs to pick up but there's like this okay there is some kind of like i don't know not weirdness like just kind of interesting i just i can't put my finger on what so oh, what i like about this music so much but it's just there's something about it that's just really kind of calm and, and its own thing now is this the right way to go or what Ugh. jesus uh, what is this? What was that? Let's that, that collected like a heap there. See, I think they give they gave us a couple more than one at once, which is nice. All right. So this level is, I think it. I don't know. I can't remember how much longer it is. Ugh. I'm gonna come back. Yeah. Okay. Back on track. Alright, so now watch if you watch this, right? You can see uh, me use the slower speed to pick up. See, like, what you wouldn't be able to do this. You wouldn't be able to fall down into this little section here either. So if you. That's what's here. Yes, that is what's here. Bloody hell, Adabu. You fell and you gotta go. But yeah, I mean, I guess maybe. No, you probably. No, you, you wouldn't have been able to make it in it without this ability. So that's why this is such a wonderfully useful ability. Alright. Doing things like this, doing little skips, doing no, well, not skips, isn't I? <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. I could imagine there not being pretty much any glitches in this game. It seems like a fairly glitchless game due to the nature of what you know. You know what it is. You know. You know what it is. Like another. Oh. I never really heard that song very many times. Like maybe only once. You know, it's like that pop culture phenomenon of a song, Black and Yellow. But I've only ever heard it like once, one time properly. Uh, Alright, that's it. What are those? Look at these re really odd crystals, too. <laughs> oh, oh, awfully sorry. Awfully sorry, friends. Oh, look at this. Look at this uh, video game challenge of, a, challenge of a lifetime right here. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. This is so difficult. Not really, but, you know. Stand back. There's a hurricane coming through. There you go. <laughs> I don't know what's right. Yeah, you know, it's probably because I don't know. Something weird about it. But uh, throw this. Looks like, looks like water, frozen water. I don't think that was their intention. That oh shit. Oops. Ah. Jesus. This video. Oh my god. This has confused the hell out of me. It's so difficult right now. I can't believe it. Uh, there we go. Let's listen to that music. It sounds great. Alright. What happens if we throw this thing on the map? Yeah. That's kind of cool. You can hear, you can, like, kind of feels like it's 
glitchy because of that. All right. There you go, make it to the top. Hit that. Oh my goodness. Look at this. We go. Oh, you get to go. Oh, cool. That's some cool stuff right there. All right. Throw it. Once you've thrown this, you basically. Look, I'll show you. Oh, oh. That would have hurt my. F oh, this guy. This guy's getting. This guy's getting tough. Good. That's what I like to see, man. That's what I like to see. All right. Oh, those sounds. It just feels like feels like something out of Kingdom Hearts. All right. Oh. Now, see, I didn't really probably explain. I think it probably should have been self-explanatory in terms of the way it looks. But um, these blue ones, right? You can't really control. You can't really control exactly what they do. Um, in terms of um. Uh, what am I trying to say? Like, in terms of, like, where you move, where you flip, it's not, it doesn't, it, it kind of gives you the direction you want to go in the first place. Now, ready, so I'm 154. Oh, wait, they only gave me one. What? They gave me one, not five? What the hell? That's weird. That, God, oh, those chords are fantastic. Alright, new section. Bert just magically arrives as usual. Tell me, Pop, this rock's a bit heavy for you, don't you think? Yeah, Bert. Okay, you're the best. Oh my. Of course, I taught you everything you know, eh? You taught him how to crush a rock by merely finger poking it to doom? Oh my goodness. Adabu, you are more impressive than I thought, my friend. More impressive than I thought. Oh, what's up here? Oh, okay, alright. Secret area. Alright. To use your brain here. Now, what happens if you drop that to the bottom? Does that mean you just can't get all the secret things here? Are they. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. If you fucked up, that'd be it. So look at. Oh, alright. Look at that. They really want you to be, use a strategy here so you don't. Miss. That's what Adabu does, though. Adabu is the king of. Oh, shit. Shit. Alright. Adabu is the king of. Um, just if you miss, yeah, exactly. You you speak the truth, my friend. You speak the truth. We are missing something, and that is this thing down here. No. Die! Oh, he's like, what? What? See, like, he's not like he's basically violent by like default. Do you know what I mean? Like, like you know, he's just, oh, you know, it's like oh, I'm just throwing a little box out there. I don't know what it's gonna do. Boom! It scares him to death with music. I mean, that's just. Wait, so you're telling me Bisbee loaded all this down? Yeah, I was gonna say, like, did Bisbee, if Bisbee could have loaded all this shit down, then why couldn't he have just done it in the first place? Like, you know, because I guess he's implying that this is all Bisbee that's made these little things, unless this universe is just filled with bouncy castles and shit. Like, you know, because we all love that. Oh. That's. There is, but. We'll get it in a sec, Adabu, don't worry. I love it how he's talking to himself, you know. He thinks he's talking to someone else, but it's, he's, it's himself. It's his own It's his own delusions, really. You know, I don't know what he's on about, man. He's just a bit of a weirdo. I love his I love his cap, though, you know. I love his cap, his muffin top. Just such a, such a, such a delightful personality at that Adabu, you know. He's got a great look, you know. He's he's, he's not, the, not the most attractive little child. Okay, okay, probably should stop there. Um... You know, but he's not, he's not the most, he's not the most attractive, uh, kid, you know, um, you know, in terms of, you know, for the like, girls on the street, the Adder, the Adder babes, um, the Adder babes, I'm sure, are not that impressed, let's be honest, um, but the Adder babes, you know, they, you know, Adabu and the Adder babes, that's it, that's, that, that's the sequel, that's his, that's his After Dark sequel, that's when he turns, that's when he becomes a big boy, that's when he becomes, uh, 13. Alright, hit him, oh, I forgot about that, it's that. Hey, what? You can't... What's going on? I've glitched the game. Oh my... That's insanity. That's cool. Alright, so now what have we got to do with this? No, no, no! No, sorry, sorry. 
So let's see, this seems a bit... Did I, did I already make use of it or something or what? Oh, oh I forgot that one there. Alright, All right, let's have a look. Anything of note? Oh. Oh yeah, I've already... Okay, all good. That's what I make. Just wanted to make sure, just wanted to make sure. You got to, you got to. Alright. Alright, there we go. It's, oh, for God's sake, what a fail. Apologies. Right. Oh. What a great ability, though. It's really nice. Alright, okay, here we go. And... Up there. Excellent. We can continue on with this wonderful level. Alright. Key collected, and we're on 226 at 228. What are we? What will we be missing? I'm just guessing that we're not going to get them all because you know the way this backtracking goes. Oh, here we are. Oi, there he is, our lava thief. <laughs> he thinks he can pick up lava in a bucket. Man, this is not real lava. They've been conned. Well, that sounds great. Then that sound, it's used in Oz uh, background music all the time. It's like that mm, sound. It's like, I don't know what it is. It's, it's weird. It's like, it's I don't, I don't know. It's in, it's in like Rayman 2 as well. It's in a lot of stuff. It's like one of those stock like effects, but it must be based on a sound or an instrument or a soundscape or I don't know, but it is, but it's like, you'll have like a bass or something like, dun, 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 mm, like that. It's interesting. All right. No what are we going to learn this time? You won't be able to shake us off. You have my word. Okay. Watch out. Don't let him lose us. He won't. All right. And here we are. Off we go. 70 this time. The challenge picks up. All right. So, um, again, we got the ability here. I just might as well go. Yes. Okay. I want to see if I can get them all this time. If That would be amazing if I get it all in one go. But you know, I likely won't, because these, these aren't just difficult. You gotta like, I don't know, there's just something really, really difficult about it. Right. See, and for example, doing that, getting the right side, like there won't be one on one side, but not on the other side. You know what I mean? So you gotta be really careful um, that you actually get the right one. Right. Who knows how it goes? This, this, this kind of. Right. Here we go. The music in this one's great, though. This isn't the same music as all the other ones. I'm pretty sure this is, sounds awesome. Oh god, don't do that game. Come on. Keep with me, keep with me. Why is it when I nearly turn turn the game off all of a sudden it gets like ten times worse? Oh ooh, sorry man. Oh shit. Is that the little gauge there how far away you are? Oh, did I oh, I bet you I missed that bastard because of the stupid focusing on this prick. You owe nothing to me. Yeah, see look. Look, like, the closer you get, the closer that bar. I should have realized. I should have realized that earlier. But like, it seems kind of pointless. There's almost no way in hell, no chance in hell, that. Um, one oh, ice strawberry juice, please. Oh, what the? F what one ice strawberry juice? Why do you want? Why do you want strawberries, you douche? Fine. Don't don't explain to us then. You just you just you drop that bombshell on us, and then all of a sudden, uh, that's it. You you you, you don't want to. Man, Adibu, you so crazy. Right. 42 out of 70. This one feels like there's a lot more of, um, of these in like a tight, tighter area, in a smaller area. Um, excellent. On our behalf, it means we can get this shit done. Right. Right. I really want to know how many we missed. I reckon we missed about two. Very nice. And look, and once again, this enemy just pretty much is... Now, I remember the final one, I do remember this. The final one of these guys actually um, is chasing you. Uh, like, and so you got to run away. And that, that's actually quite a fun, fun one as well. But a, lot, a bit, bit more difficult because of, like, I think, at least I remember it being a little bit more so. Because you can't see the, um, these things as well. Unless they don't have them, I, don't, I can't remember. Anyway, look at that draw distance there. Here we are. 58. Oh, that's some that's some strategy there. They really want you to use your trickery there. Right. It's getting quite hot here. Damn right, Adabu. Thank you for speaking the truth to yourself. So you need to reassure. Yes, it's getting hot. It's getting hot. Right. Anyway, so let's see. 
the more we get, the more happy I'm going to be with my performance. 68. Oh, wow. We missed one. That stupid, shitty one that... Oh, no. Color me disappointed. Alright. Great. Done. Okay. Let's get out of here. Checking memory card. Yep, saving data. And boss time. Here we go again. Here we go. The lava reservoir is up there. So, um, all we've got to do is make it overflow. Oh, oh God. How bizarre. There's no box this time. I think that if we stay on the colored areas, boxes will appear. Try going on the area that's the same color as the door. Very nice. That's some good strategy right there. Okay, so that means we have to stand on each box. So we've got to stand on a red box. Oh, no, that's purple. What are you going to do with that? Hey, mate, what are you going to do? Oh, shit, he's chasing me. Wait, go on. Power it up. All right, that's pretty simple. Look at that. Oh, oh shit. A box. <gasps> a box. Oh. Go, you Wait. Quick, do oh, God, what happens if you... What happened? Yeah, what would happen if you just, um... If you left it, would you have died? Would Adabu have finally perished in this battle? Oh, shit. You never want that to happen, but it just does. So. Chase me over here, mate. Chase me over here. Oh god, this guy's fast. This guy's a lot better than the other one. Yes! Yes! Oh, oh what? He's like, you wanna go, mate? Got him. And now green. Excellent. And yes, we've got enough time this time, sucker. Quick, oh, he's, he's right. Oh, he's ran, he's ran. That's unbelievable. What a freak of yes. nature this man is. This robot, sorry. Thank you, I am a clever one, aren't I? With the lava on his face. That's disgusting. Alright, here we go. So he doesn't chase you here. It's like, it's like he's so delu delirious that he just he can't do anything. I love it. Right, come on. Done. Ugh. Oh my god. Stop calling him a scrap heap. He has a name. BX1035. Okay? Get your Adaboo history right. He, he has nothing to say anymore. He's just like, this is bullshit. I'm going to have to get him myself after this. Okay, well... What do we got in store for us in the Adabu world? I think there's something to do with fishing or something like that. I was on the boat. And then I think we can use that that boat in the next level, I think. Um, let's have a look. Oh, well done. You're on the right track. Thank you. As far as I know, your next destination is underwater. You'll need some special equipment to get there. To start with, you'll need to collect a bamboo stick from the island. Ooh. To the island? All right then. Let's find the dinghy first. <laughs> that, that's what I think of when I think of the island. All right. So I reckon that, given that this to mission to takes dinghy, press the action button. a little bit longer. Are we going in the dinghy? Um, Have a look up there to see I know that the, I know the final level will, will split into two parts. Got to turn the yep. So that my back is okay. Towards the direction you want to go. Okay. Then keep going in yep. that direction. Will do. Yep. Move. Thank you for the tip. All right. So really? uh, let's give that a go. Hey, are we going yes, in we are going in. All right. So yeah, actually, no, I was thinking. Uh, The fuck? Hey, are we going in the dinghy? You know, these controls are always a load of shit. Right. 
Yeah, okay, wait. So you turn around that way. That way. I want to keep going. I want to keep going, you retard. Come on. And go. No, just... Okay, okay, so what? I want to fucking go now, mate. Alright? Okay, I'm not... Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. I never understood this. Go that way. Okay. And then all of a sudden it just chooses to go. It's like... Okay. Now go. Ready, watch. It's as if... Right, ready, watch. Watch what happens. Ready? All of a sudden, you hold it down. And then, all of a sudden, boom. How do you just do it normally? I don't want to have to have to do some load of bullshit to, to go... Yeah. Make that makes zero sense, guys. I just want to point that out. That makes absolutely no sense. It just chooses when it wants to. See? Ridiculous. This is fucking shit. Right. Right. N I don't understand how to do this, but. Right. Right. No, other way, mate. Okay, here we go, and go. Oh wait, just oh, just choose this fucking direction you want to go in, you absolute fuck. Push in the direction you want to go, what the fuck? No, no, just for once in your goddamn life, could you actually make a control that isn't a complete worthless piece of garbage? This makes me sick, you absolute degenerate scum. I think I may have figured it out. So in the direction, ready, see, so stop, 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 oh my god, okay, ready? And then when you get to that point, you aim the directional button. No, other way. Other way. Yep. No, wait. Back, back. And then you aim it diagonal like that. And then that makes sense. Here we go. Oh, rejoice. Poo your face, mate. Let's go and get this famous bamboo the Bisbee's been telling us about. Yeah. Yes, we've got the Yeah, yeah, screw you, mate. Yep, piss off. Yeah, so do I. Yep. Yep, Adabu, yep. Okay, stop talking. Let's go and meet him at the volcano. Okay, we'll do. Alright, well, now we have to get back. Which is a disaster. Um right, ready? And here we go. I finally kind of understand it, but it's a bit too fidgety for my liking, you know, it's just not yeah. It's a bit shit. No, wrong way. Yeah, and we're out. Oh, what a goddamn relief. So yeah, in the next part we're going to be going to the final levels. Um, let's see what Bisbee has to say. Good old Bisbee. Did you miss me, Bisbee? What a genius. Here's the snorkel. Now you've got what you need to swim underwater. Oh my God. So with this snorkel, I'll actually, I'll literally be able to breathe underwater? <laughs> really? Literally. Oh, Correct use of literally. Me. You're excellent. I'm ready for the waterfalls now. So am I. The waterfalls is really cool, actually. Um, so in the next part, we're going to be going to the waterfalls, and then after that, some backtracking, and then more exploration of this little weird little place, because we haven't even talked to half these guys. I mean, it is probably just really mindless banter, kind of Pokemon city traveling-esque, but, you know, we'll see. Anyway, in the next part, we're going to be going to the final world. So thank you for watching, guys. See you.